Hey everybody, this is Captain Dennis and I've got Liz, Firefighting Liz, in the car. We're up at um, in Meriden for the Connecticut Scuba Tri Scuba and Liz is going to try scuba. So we just wanted to ask her a couple questions um, about what her thoughts are about uh, exploring scuba. If she has any uh, apprehensions or expectations. So take it away, Liz. So as far as apprehensions go, um, I'm pretty comfortable with breathing apparatus from firefighting. So it doesn't feel like that would be that much of an adjustment for me, but um, I've never done anything like that under the pressure of water. So that's gonna be a new experience. And do you have any like concerns about like equalizing or any of that good stuff? Um, I don't think so. I never really had any big problems like that when I was younger, but- What about airplanes? Airplanes? No, I just always had chewing gum, so yeah. <laughs> not a big deal. I think the uh, the less I think about it, the less I'll worry about it. We'll figure oh. it out when we get in there. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to ask Liz what she thought after she tried scuba. So we'll be back. Stick around. <laughs> Good stuff? Oh, yeah. Everything you expected? Everything I expected most. Fair enough. <laughs> so we're back. So I'm sure you enjoyed all the pool footage, but we've got Tom from Connecticut Scuba and Liz, who is our guinea pig um, firefighter who had tried school for the first time. And I'm just kind of curious what your thoughts are after you got a chance to get in the water. It was awesome. See? That was a really good time. It was actually a little bit easier to adapt to than I was expecting and it was impressive how much the buoyancy is uh, affected with your breathing and everything like that. There's a lot of things that I didn't realize. And does it sound like it's something you're gonna move forward on? Uh, yeah. Good Absolutely. enough. I can't wait. That's, that's why that's, Tom does this. The first taste is free. That's 90% of the response we get. They love it. Yeah, it's a great time. Now, Tom, if somebody wanted to try scuba, when would they, how would they get a hold of you? And Go on our website, www.ctscuba.org, and look under our calendar. It's, and I think it's, is it normally like a regular thing per month? We have the pool the last week in the very month at the Meriden YMCA. There you go. So if you're in Connecticut, check out the Meriden YMCA and go to connecticutscuba.org. And you can find, oh, the camera's moving. See you later. <laughs>